Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to another episode of Infinite Lock. It's your boy Eric, and today we have more in mix reactions. We have the Tank um, 4K Studio Choom. I haven't heard the Tank song at all. I've only heard the preview, the the freaky fishy uh, thing that went viral and everybody was talking about it. Um, but I haven't heard the song in itself. Um, and then we're gonna watch the dance practice for OO. Um, yeah, let's jump into it. I, I really said I've seen a lot of people saying lately that the songs are growing on them i said that after the first reaction i think i commented on a, a bunch of k-pop pages and i'm like look you guys can say what you want jyp is head of a big three for a reason um i'm sure he did not hear this and was like and, and didn't put this out for a reason the bad publicity that they got all the hating is still publicity it kept them in the media eye long enough for the song to start growing on everybody which is typically how it goes in k-pop what i've noticed a lot it's a lot of growers they put a, it's a lot of songs in k-pop that are meant to be growers it's typically not like that in other aspects of music in other aspects of music it's typically like if people don't like it like especially western music and people don't like it out the gate and it's just it is what it is but in k-pop a lot of songs grow on people i think that's just by design how they do it and i knew for a fact what the second time i heard oh oh i'm like look this is gonna be this is gonna grow on a lot of people especially if the audio version it has smoother transitions i'm pretty sure almost 100 percent sure that he did that on purpose in the video so people would be agitated and have things to say about it or whatever i'm sure he prepared the girls for what was for the backlash and all that stuff just be strong just perform well and they they i've heard they've been smashing their performances left and right the vocals have been on point i've seen clips of lily absolutely slaying her notes jenny is a superstar q Jen is is probably my is my bias record i really love her energy um and so yeah let's get into this um before we get into the video make sure you guys like comment subscribe to your post notifications on got a lot of stuff coming your way and uh yeah let's check this out i really think that the talent level is there for them i really think so this is a talented group of girls oh okay it's them joints JYP ain't playing. He got that ancient tone. Hey, hey, hey. That's what I'm saying. He knew that snippet was going to get people riled up. This song, that when you hear the actual song, it sounds way. She's so, she looks so much like Sana and Chewy, a mix of El Choker. So that was N Mix with Tank uh, 4K Studio Tune. Um, yeah, the, it sounds a million times better than the snippet. Um, it's just I, I really think that this stuff is by design. I told I've, I've said I've quoted this before about what Floyd Mayweather has said. Um, he said, "Look, if a million people come watch me fight, more than half of those people are there to watch me lose. But you know what? They paid." So they paid the purse that I'm going to take after this fight. They paid my bills to come see me, to, to come hope and hate for me to, and want me to lose. So it doesn't matter. I appreciate all of that. And I think that that just goes to show like that just goes to show like all publicity sometimes can be good publicity, depending on what it is. I, they got a lot of that bad publicity, but I think it just kept them in a lot of people's mouths for such a long time. Meanwhile, they're still breaking records. They're still setting this, setting this uh, while still being the number one topic on, on everybody's mind because of the controversialness of the song. And now it's growing on people. So now they're just reaping the benefits still, even time later. Um, I think it was ingenious on, on JYP's part. I said this, I said this before. Um, I really think that these girls are super talented. Um, they they can dance their butts off like, like a JYP girl group can. Their choreography is on point. Um, their transitions into, into said choreography is on point. All of them have something special. Um, Lily vocally, they all they all sound great vocally. I will say that I, I think this is one of the best JYP groups in terms of vocal. Um, I will say that, um, not, not to say that the others aren't, I just think that they are really, really good vocally to be so young and so, so out the gate. Lily carried that Tank song vocally. 
um, just you know they just gave her a lot of the parts um, but she's 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 main vocal for sure she has a hell of a voice um, Q Jin love her personality love what she brings to the table and then Jenny is a hell of a center she's a hell of a center all of them play such a crucial part so let's watch the OO dance practice very very sick sick already I love Kyujin's outfit. Hey. Show, show, show. <laughs> zoom, zoom, good. Popping it, popping it, popping it now. Hey, hey. Popcorn and zero coat. Come in. Teaser coming soon. Come on, hey man, hey man, hey hey, come on, hey one, hey, hey, hey. Bay looks tall as hell. I don't know why. Her and Sillion look tall as hell. Bella, 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 Nihana, ha, nice. Come on, Kyujin. Nihana, ha, nice. Hey. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, I love that. I saw that. I saw that snippet on Instagram. So that's how I saw that. FYI, I think I got Jiwoo and Kyujin mixed up in the tank video. One time, I think I got them mixed up um, because I'm pretty sure Kyujin had the pigtail, the braids. Um, but I'm pretty sure Jiwoo is the one with the uh, hat on now. In mix. Cause everything is fake, but I ain't a fake. Why do I know? <laughs> I've only listened to this song one time. And it not not come and follow me. Superhero. Hey, Kujin. Hey, hey. Mm, my superhero. Come on, hey one. Awan is better vocally than I than I thought. She, I like her vocal. Finally, will be. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, Lily. <laughs> Lily is eating this up she, vocally. She's eating it up. Watch Suliyun. The, the space silly Yoon covers. I've mentioned this with Chewy before from twice. Watch the space she covers. Watch where she came from. She's in the middle of the screen. She gets all the way to the outside in like a three count. Up there. Up there, up there. Ooh, ooh. This part right here be getting me lit. Come on, Jenny. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> that lean back is crazy. 
Yeah, they fire, bro. The game is in trouble. The industry is in trouble once they finally find their rhythm. The industry is in trouble. So that was in mix with OO dance practice. Um, fire, absolutely fire. Uh, the song is is definitely a grower. Um, I I me personally, I wouldn't listen to the, I, the whole audio version consistently just because of the way that they structured it. But it's not a bad song by any means. Um, and I think the girls are so talented that they made up for anything the song lacked they made up for it whenever companies kind of do this kind of multi beat multi i feel like it's more to just showcase the talent level of the girls and not necessarily come out with a hit um not to say that espa songs aren't hits not to say that in mix's song isn't a hit for some people i'm just saying that i feel like with these releases they that the primary objective is to show is to introduce the girls to the world and let people know what they have the potential to be and do and they definitely did that um they i they the the performances they smash it um they can sing they can dance i i really think the sky is the limit for them um because they really don't have any weaknesses honestly i, I the only thing i i think is like who's gonna take up the rap mantle going forward if they do that but i mean honestly like you don't need you don't need aggressive rap to be a top girl group or just to be a top group i i I just think that they have enough uh swag and energy i think that some of the members definitely do have that kind of um I, I won't even say girl crush but that swag uh to go for i think qjen definitely has it she's very animated um very animated i love her personality i really think that's what led her to be my my bias record i really love her personality and just just the cheerfulness that she has all the time and then jenny is just she's she's a hell of a center i think that she's going to be one of the top centers in the game moving forward she just radiates that center energy whenever she's in the middle it's like time stops and you're looking at her she just has a lot of power in that center um they 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 cover a lot of ground with their choreography um height wise i feel like their heights vary but i mean lily suliyun and bay especially all look to be pretty tall um especially bay bay looks she looks really really tall um in a lot of their stuff um they they cover a lot of ground i said that about suliyun earlier she she covered a lot of ground from the center she got all the way to the outside um i i just think the talent level is there and i think that jyp knew what he was doing with that first release because if you really think about it it's been nothing it's been paying off for them big time um and the girls are just so likable i just feel like you know I, i've come across a couple people i'm not supporting them this is not a i don't like that i don't like how he did I, again blaming their idols for things out of their control they're a new group they literally have to do 100 percent of what they're told um I think for me, I wasn't so when when groups debut, it's not so much do I like the song, it's do I like the members, do I like the talent level, you know what I'm saying? Because they don't control whatever song that they get. So do I like how they execute the song? 100%. Do I like the song? It's growing on me. I won't necessarily listen to it on a daily basis, but it's definitely growing on me. But I 100% love the talent level and how they, how this particular group of girls executed the song. I support. I'm supporting the girls, not necessarily the 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 release. You know what I mean? I'm supporting the girls. I really think that they have the talent level to make a push for the top of the generation as they get more releases later on down the line. Um, and yeah, I'm interested to see where their career goes from here. So yeah, before you guys go, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, turn your post notifications on. Got a lot of stuff coming your way. And uh, yeah, till next time.